What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. And it looked like uh, Tay 600 then finally spoke on No Limit Cairo interview that he had when he kind of spoke on saying Tay 600 did tell on Rondo and C Day and he synced it and he kind of told stories about what happened to Tay 600 inside the jails because he was locked up during the time Tay was locked up. You know, when they asked Tay this question, Tay didn't really get his question any any kind of, you know, energy to build up bigger. He kind of threw that question away. He basically said, if it's on the Internet, it's not real. You know, he not going to make a career a troll and a career of dissing people. That's not where he came from. You know, he talented, basically. He basically saying, you know, that shit that Cairo was doing, it wasn't really real. Because if it was real, it never would have been on the Internet. He basically saying, you know, every time somebody say something on the Internet, you don't take it serious to the point where you're willing to throw your life away. This is entertainment. People get on this shit to have fun. So it felt like he kind of dodged it a little bit. Then it felt like he took the grown way out. You know, he's not going to let that shit grow. T-600 got a big fan base. He focused on making music, you know, focus on doing something with his career. The entertain beef back and forth is not really smart. It ain't going to do nothing but make the bloggers is rich um, and give people content to create and rumors to speculate about and I think Tay 600 didn't realize that that shit happened a long time ago it's time to end that shit the more he talk about it the longer it's gonna be in the air you know uh, it's rumors that he did things he said he didn't do things paperwork came out said he did things paperwork came out said he didn't do things we don't know to this point I think Tay 600 didn't clear this name up if you ask me now it is paperwork that it came out that point the wild shit but you know we don't know if these paperwork is real or not this shit didn't happen a long time ago people still lying on that uh relying on that is kind of crazy to me but i wanted to bring to your attention that taste 600 and spoke out on that interview that cairo did and he didn't really go hard on him seemed like he not entertaining anything that got that old school rondo and see they shit to it subscribe to my youtube channel it's the homie truth Blah.